I'd like to demonstrate the process of creating two different models in SAS Enterprise Miner. Uh, in this case, the models are going to have a binary outcome. So first I'm going to create a new diagram and I'm going to call this uh, example analysis. I'm going to pull down this organics data set. I note that there are 22,223 observations. One of the things I need to do before I create my models is I need to partition the data. So I'll pull down a data partition and I'll make it so it splits the data 50-50. And now I will go to model and I will create a decision tree. I will also pull down a regression node. And then I will just do the defaults and click run. And this may take a moment. It has completed, so I will view the results. After viewing the results, the thing that I want to see is how well this model performed, and so I go down here to average squared error, and I see that it's 0.13, so I'll write this down, 0.13. 34473. All right, with that done, even though I can see that there are 26 leaves on my tree, etc., I'm not really concerned about that. I just want to know how well did my model do. So now I'm going to go over to my other model and create that. I'm now viewing the results of the regression node and I look again at average squared error and I look for uh, and I look for that value and it happens to be 0.154774. Now I haven't looked specifically at what is found uh, in these models in terms of which variables were selected for the purposes of predicting new cases but I do know that uh, an error is a bad thing, and so uh, I want to pick the one, the model, that has the lowest error involved with its predictions, and I see that this one has lower error than that one. And so uh, from the two models, I should look more closely at that. Now another way that we commonly compare models is by looking at the misclassification rate. Uh, if you watched carefully or if you went back in this video you'll note that there was no misclassification rate in the previous output nor is there any in this one. Do you know why?